This arithmetic reasoning practice test question for the ASVAB and PyCat says, if a teacher reviews four and one half papers per hour, how many papers will that teacher review in six and one third hours? So if it's helpful, you can set up a proportion to solve this one. Again, proportions are nothing more than two fractions that are set equal to each other. And in this case, let's fill it in like this. We know the teacher can review four and one half papers every hour. That's going to be proportional to or equal to the number of papers they can review. That's unknown, so call it X, over six and one third hours. We solve proportions via cross multiplication. This becomes one times X, which is just X, equals four and one half times six and one third. Let's go ahead and work this out to get our answer. The first thing I'm going to do is convert these uh, mixed numbers to improper fractions. So let's do that. Four times two is eight plus one is nine. So four and a half is the same thing as nine over two. Uh, six times three is 18 plus one is 19. So this is 19 over three. Before we multiply these fractions, let's go ahead and try to cross reduce as much as possible. In this case, I could say three goes into three one time, three goes into nine three times. So this is 3 over 2 times 19 over 1. When you multiply fractions, you multiply straight across. So this becomes 2 times 1, which is 2. 3 times 19. So as not to make a mistake, I'm going to do that off to the side. We have 19 times 3. Uh, 9 times 3 is 27. Bring down a 7, carry a 2. 3 times 1 is 3 plus 2 is 5. So this is 57 over 2. And of course, we're going to convert this either to a whole number or a mixed number by doing long division. Again, I could read this as 57 divided by 2. 2 goes into 5 uh, 2 times without going over. 2 times 2 is 4. 5 minus 4 is 1. Drop down this 7. Uh, 2 goes into 17 8 times without going over. Uh, 2 times 8 is 16. 17 minus 16 is 1. And we have enough information to write our mixed number. This 28 is going to be our whole number. This remainder of 1 is going to be our numerator. And this 2 is going to be our denominator. So in other words, this teacher can review 28 and 1 half papers over 6 and 1 third hours. So this one is going to be A.